When it comes to art, you are in total control of your own learning process. It doesn't matter if you went to art school or if you're pursuing it as a hobby later in life. You only get better in one way, relentlessly tackling your own weaknesses. Maybe your weakness is drawing cars, or maybe it's the way that the neck connects to the torso. In this video, I'm going to introduce an exercise which is aimed at tackling these challenge areas. The exercise is simple. Pick something that you'd normally avoid, and then draw it a hundred times. You're not going for speed, so there's no time limit. The idea is to force yourself to internalize an unfamiliar structure. So here I've got the first page of my 100 drawings. The subject I've chosen is not anatomy, which would be too broad, but instead, arms. Specifically, arms in natural poses. Whenever I'm doing illustrations, I seem to get held up on the musculature of arms, so it's time to improve. To tackle this, I popped in a few movies with heroic figures and began to collect screenshots. These shots now serve as my reference for arms in motion. You could also take photos of your friends, but I find that movies are a great place to find action. These drawings are just for you. You probably won't ever show them to anyone, so don't worry about the presentation. Worry about the structure. Make sure you're not distracted while you're working. Look carefully and think about the form. When I'm getting started with my 100 drawings, sometimes I like to trace for the first 10 or so. Tracing is a great way to dissect your object into simplistic forms. Complex objects are much easier to internalize if you can picture them as a group of simple forms. Once I've traced a few, I'll draw the remainder with my reference next to my image. It can help to work at a 100% scale so that you can quickly eyeball the proportions without doing any mental enlarging. Improving your drawing is never easy. The goal of this exercise is to put you outside of your comfort zone and to stay there for 100 drawings. But remember, you're the only one in control of your learning process. No one is going to force you to do exercises like this, because no one really knows your trouble spots. So I challenge you to pick something that you've really been running from and draw it 100 times. Good luck.